I'm Linda Hoover. I live uh, about 10 miles north of Sedalia in the Houstonia, Hughesville area and have been painting all my life <laughs> since uh, I was always the class artist. Right now I'm president of Sedalia Visual Artists and we have a wonderful group, a very diverse group. Uh, this mural behind us is at on the Fine Art Building, Fine Arts Building, at the State Fair, and I have two big ones outside in Sedalia. There's one right across from the courthouse, Sedalia Stars, and that features Sedalia has actually been the home of a lot of and place that people went through school here that went on to become nationally famous for different things. So they, we did a mural about that, some of the famous people. And there's the newest one is at Liberty Park, right across from the pool. And it's a truly Missouri thing, but it's, the idea was to take something that was a, an eyesore and turn it into something people would enjoy. So it's a real floral mural with our, the dogwood is Missouri uh, tree. It's got a hawthorn tree, which is Missouri flower. It's got bluebirds, that's Missouri birds, and a bullfrog, that's our amphibian, and a box turtle, that's our reptile, and I may be leaving something out. But there's a little, there's a goldfish pond in it, so it's just kind of a, meant to be pretty outdoor, springy scene with blue skies that on a day like this can perk people up. And they are enjoying it and having fun with it. There's a wrought iron uh, bench in it that says welcome and people are backing up to that and acting like they're sitting on it and it really in a photograph it really works good it was what I would have entered in the Mo 50 this year or I did enter it but we didn't get far enough to judge or select them and it's my favorite medium watercolor my mother worked in watercolor and I have always loved watercolor. It is just what it is. It's a fruit salad. I've been working on a theme the past few years and actually because when I went through all my art and looked for themes, this is a theme that always keeps popping up. Human beings and human doings. I do portraits and I do caricatures and I do paintings and I, when I'm somewhere like I did a watercolor at the ocean I do it on on the spot but people and what they do is what really uh, is my theme uh, always do my my portraits or caricatures but always growing in my art and I have judged shows before I don't people want to be have some confidence in the judge that they have something in mind and I have thought about it a great deal how I should do that but my process would usually be to go through them all look for what's really standing out and uh, then go back and consider the craftsmanship in the work and what is just really aesthetically uh, moving me and I've been drawing all my life and my mother was an artist who always encouraged me so I remember being very little and being in brownies and having art and uh, just little art lessons at school and my mother would sign me up for summer art things and uh, just always involved in it. Um, I have judged myself for the high school here. The high schools, they have a yearly thing. And I've judged that several times where all the high schools in the city put up a show. And I've judged for Jefferson City and for uh, the different the high school in Smithton and the high school uh, Knob Noster 
So I have Judge Owen, the uh, show that used to be down in Stover, the Palm Sunday art show. And I've given a lot of thought to how this, how you should pick. Really looking forward to seeing your show, to seeing the art that you produce, and to judging it, and to doing my very best job at this. Uh, I do want to encourage you too, though, if you don't get a prize this year, You'll get a different judge next year, they'll have a little different taste, and you've always got uh, another chance to keep at it. I mean, there'll probably be, I don't know how many prizes you can give, but there will be lots of good art in this, and, and I'll, I'd like to give a lot of prizes. <laughs> and you're so, one judge, and actually we're going to yes. be doing a people's choice. Yes, there'll be so, a people's uh, choice. There'll be an opportunity for people to, um, to actually the, the public to uh -huh. to vote as well. So that's another prize that they can get. Excellent. Yeah. And Thank you, Linda, so much.